Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Dan and for those of you who haven't been onto this channel before, welcome, have a look around. There's plenty of videos and plenty of plays for you to have a look at and I hope you enjoy what you see. Today I am reacting to some more of The Warning. That is right, I am going through the whole discography of The Warning. But before I do that, I just want to let you guys know that there is ways for you to support this channel if you so wish. If you want your own personalised song request granted to you, I do have a Patreon, a Buy Me A Coffee or a PayPal account. The links for those are underneath the screen. If you want to send me a special little birthday gift, like a donation um, alongside your request, it is my birthday on Saturday, please do not hesitate to go down into the links and click on the links and donate as much or as little as you want. There is no pressure for you to do that. That's not, not what I'm looking for on this channel. But if you do wish to send me something for my birthday, please, the links are underneath the screen. But that's not what you're here for. You're here for this reaction. So I'm making my way through the all of the warning discography. Um, in the last video, a lot of people have said that I should be, I should do the vlogs. Um, I have decided actually, after I've done this album, uh, the album that I'm making my way through, I will be doing the vlogs and then I'll be moving on to the next album. Um, I also have found out that Narcissista, Narcissista, I believe that's the song, isn't part of any album. So that is going to be a separate thing as well that I'm going to react to before I move on to the next album after this one that I'm reacting to. So I just wanted to make that all clear. I wanted to clarify that. But anyway, I'm moving on. So this is the song Sinister Smiles. It's off the album Queen of the Murder Scene. So far, this album has just been absolutely phenomenal. It's been absolutely phenomenal. This is probably going to be the similar that I'm going to really like this song. But as you know that in these reactions, I do um, the studio version, then I do the live version. So you get best of both worlds in the reaction. I've spoken too much. I'm just going to go ahead and press play. Straight in. You don't know. You have nothing left but this body you control. I'd walk away, but before mm. I could start, sinister smiles shut me up, and they opened up their mouths to say, Hey. Get on that bass sound there. Hey, little girl, do you feel satisfied? Have you quenched the hunger that was still torn? I love the rolling feel of this song. When I say I won't let you get hurt, but if I am to burn, then you will never get to walk away. Love this, man. kind of effect that the girls have been doing with this. The drumming as well is really shining out. Oh! They're bringing a bit of metal into this, are they? Hey. Break, just break 
Alright! It's got a groove now. Come on, Danny. This is a banger! This is another thing I do not like. This was a perfectly good song and they just faded it out. I don't know why they do this. I don't know why bands, like, they play amazing, perfectly good songs and it just fades out. I don't, I don't get it. Um, maybe it's because they don't, just don't know how to finish the song. That's, that's fine. But it's kind of a pet hate of mine when a banger like this, which was a really, really good song, just fades out. I'm like, I want to hear the end of it. What's happening? You know? Um, I'll go on, well, I'm just going to go on to what I found interesting about this. Um, basically, there's so many genres added in with this song. Like, there's that groove of normal rock. There was a bit of pop punk added into it. There was a bit of emo added into it. There was also, there was a bit where it got quite heavy. I was like, are they adding metal into this now? Like, you know, it had like a metal element into it. I think what shone out to me during the track was Powell's drumming. Um, very crystal clear in this, very crisp and clear. And I, I really liked that. Anyway, I'm going to go on to the next one, which is the live version of this song. So this is the live version of Sinister Smiles by The Warning. That it is a live at Lumario, Lunario, sorry, CDMX. I'm gonna stop talking. Let's get into this reaction and play. Hey, girl, Come on, pal. You don't know. Yes. You have nothing left but the yeah, those hands up in the air. Oh, she's singing. She's ferocious, man. Oh, nice guitar. Oh, feels really gnarly. Come on, where's the crowd singing along with it? Hey, her drumming is superb. I'm loving the sound of Danny's guitar there. It's got a beautiful echoey sound. On the, on the snares there. I love how both of them are singing.
That flowy sound, it's got like a flowing sound, I love it. Hey! She is a monster on the drum. Don't even know what I'm saying there. Yeah, come on crowd, come on, scream it. Interesting to see how they're gonna end this. How you end a song? Oh lord. Okay, okay, so let me just be honest. Um loved how they ended the song. <laughs> just getting that out of the way. What really shone out to me was it seems like it was Danny and Pow singing together. Ali's bass was just as usual, so enhanced I could actually feel the bass. Um, Danny's guitar, the echoey kind of sound to it, I really like that. The song itself is an absolute anthem, and as hard as it's going to say, I think this is one of my favourites. <laughs> I've probably said this about every other warning song, but I actually mean it right now, where I am on the journey. This is one of my favourites. Um, it just had everything in there for me, like... The rhythm, the kind of mixture of genres added together, I really liked that. I really, really did. Anyway, enough about me. What did you guys think? Did you enjoy this song? Did you enjoy this reaction? If you did, please press the like button now. If you want to comment, what did you, let me know what you thought of this, um, this song, either versions. Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you. Also, if you just come onto this video and you like what you've seen and you haven't pressed the subscribe button, please press that subscribe button. This is your channel as much as it's mine and you're more than welcome onto here. For those of you who have already subscribed, I just want to say a heartfelt, honest thank you so much. Couldn't honestly be here without you. You guys make this channel. That's it for me in this video. My name is Dan. You guys are incredibly awesome. I'll see you in the next video. I hope you're safe. I hope you're well. I love you all. God bless you. Peace.